Here we go. Use case number two. Back in the old days, it was possible for a professional boxer to create what was called a syndicate. And a syndicate will essentially go outside and find investors for the boxer's career. Financing things like the training, the coaching, the equipment, the food, and everything around the boxer's career. The investors would invest on front for the boxer's career in exchange of a piece of the boxer's future earnings in the form of an income tax statement. Within this transaction, there was many people sitting in the middle. Each person obviously getting a piece of the earnings of the boxer's career. Thanks to the blockchain technology, now we have smart contracts where the boxer can create a smart contract offering people to get into the on-front economics with the promise of getting something of the future earnings. In this case, the blockchain is essentially automating and creating the syndicate for everybody and everything. Opening up at the same time a peer-to-peer -peer infrastructure or ecosystem that makes social change and in the process is questioning everything and everybody that sits in the middle of these types of transactions. Think about professional boxers like Mike Tyson and many other examples that they know they have the talent but they don't have the on-front economics so proceed to find for outside investors and obviously one could do the same exact thing for actors and musicians.